Hey everyone, it's me, LPS Toasty Shootle here, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be opening up some new in box Littles pet shops that I found at the thrift store. I've had these guys for a while now, and I've been super excited to open them, so I figured there's no better time than the present, so let's see them. Just to scooch over here. So well, here's the first package. In the package, it comes with a little gorilla and a super adorable cat. It says that the names are Terrence Konga and Pearl McSweeney. I'm not sure what you guys think, but I'm totally not a fan of Hasbro's names for the pet shops. Like, 9 out of 10 times, the names don't make sense or they're just incredibly cheesy. On the back, there's this little sticker. I actually purchased this at Once Upon a Child for $2.50 which is a really good deal considering these are the G4 pets instead of the new G5, and I think this is a lot cheaper than the original retail price. Ugh, guys, I can't wait any longer. We have to open this. So let's open it. Oh, this is gonna be awful. Oh, that came up easy, actually. Oh no, I knocked everything over. E. that is not good. Um, oh, we got the back off. So this came out. Ah, great hands, um, angles, the beautiful hands. I'm sorry, guys. I think I'm gonna buy scissors for this. I'm gonna need scissors. Where are they? I'm so sorry guys, I take, I do this like in every opening video. I take so long to open packages. You'd think I would open off camera now, but I don't. Did it actually pop out? Oh, okay. And then we'll look at the always go flying on me. Oh, and they won't come back. Oh my gosh, guys, everything is falling. Oh, this is not good. Um, yeah, like I'm not, I hate how they put the next strings in here because those are hard to get out. But the deckle are by far the worst, so I'll be right back. Cut them out of the package, I actually had to cut them out. First up we have this little pamphlet. In here we actually have the pets that we just got and like there's tons of little pet shops like I remember actually getting some of these in store and I remember when these were so new. It's like here's the back and yeah I kind of ripped it. <laughs> now it's time to review the sets. First up we have this uh, gorilla and this is the main part of the set. I'm not gonna lie. I think Hasbro could have made this a lot more cute. I'm not a big fan. Oh goodness. I'm not a big fan of this body type. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, it's very awkward. And this hand is kind of bothering me. I wish that they would have just like gave it a regular body. And the ears are normally small for the head. Uh, but other than that, it's, it's cute. Um, yeah, it's, it's cute. I'm not going to really complain about it. It was a good deal. And honestly, I mostly got it for the cat anyway. But yeah, like I would have liked this a lot better if Hasbro wouldn't have gave it this awkward body type. All this time, guys, I thought he was like giving me a hand gesture. But he's actually just giving me a thumbs up. So, I mean, that's nice. That's nice. He's giving me the support. He's like, thumbs up. Ooh, ooh, oh, that neck. Oof. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's time for you to go. I have absolutely no complaints for this little pet shop. It's super cute and I definitely love her little green eyes and the fact that it looks like she has whipped cream on her head. I love the deco bits. I also like that you can make it look like she's holding a teddy bear. I think that it was an adorable little touch. So that set was really adorable and I'd give it 4 out of 5. The kitten was cute and I love that it can hold a teddy bear. All that I have to say about this set really is that I don't like Hasbro's choice of body mold for the gorilla. Now here's the next set and the names are again Wallace Waterman and Sally Seaforth. It comes with this adorable walrus and seahorse and these three adorable deco bits. And once again, I'm not a huge fan of the names. Looks like someone opened it and they had to tape it down, which is okay because everything in the package is still intact. And I also got this at Once Upon a Child, but instead it's now $3.50, which I don't know why it was $2.50 on the one, but $3.50 on this. But anyway, no complaints because it's still a really good deal. So let's open it up, if I can. This, this tape is going to make it like impossible for me. Okay, well, I'm gonna try to open it up. I'm gonna move this LPS back before I, like, destroy everything in my path because this tape is going to the end of me. Yep, right where I tear it, they taped it all down. Oh, goodness. Wait a minute. Okay. Like, they really taped this down. I don't think they have to do it this much. But... Ooh. They're like... Oh, yeah. <laughs> Knocking everything down and over and... I mean, look at that. That's, like, very big tape. I think I may have gotten it open a little. Try to peel the side. Ah. No. Uh, now the next part, which will probably be worse. Uh, scissors, I need scissors. I guess I know my scissors are disgusting. I'm not that great anymore. I've had these for a long time. Get it open. Didn't cut it all the way. <laughs> Guys, this is why these videos take forever for me, because I just take a long time to open the shops. Like that. Pop this guy out. This is just hot. Oh no. Okay. I don't think this 
coming out, but the seagulls cannot. And over here, I have made an absolute mess. And we have the same pamphlet. I'm not going to show that since I already showed it for the first pet. We also have these three adorable deco bits. We have a sea star, a shell, and a little shovel. Here we have this guy. He's adorable. I'm not going to lie. He's just super cute. I like that they made him, like, adorable. Uh, his, he's got tiny fins and a large body. Uh, he's got like this little hair and he's falling over. The only thing I'm kind of like not liking about him, and this isn't like Hasbro, I think this is just the person that owned him before, but guys, look at all that dirt. And he was in the package. Look at, he's dirty. That's okay though, because like I can clean him off. Oh, we like almost match. Guys, we almost match. So I'm really liking him. He's super cute. And I absolutely have to zoom out because he's not going to fit in frame. Um, I absolutely love this little seahorse. He was like one of the reasons I... Ooh, he doesn't stand well, but he was one of the reasons why I wanted the package. I mean, look at him. He, I love his colors. I'd probably use him in some photo shoots. He's adorable, and that is a weird angle for my hand. Oh my goodness. Okay. So he doesn't stand well, but that's fine. He's super cute, and I may use him in videos, but probably more... I'll use him in photo shoots. I just realized that his mouth, the little hole, is a deco bit. This doesn't really make any sense considering the deco bits they gave me. It wouldn't make any sense if you were eating the seashell, the, the shovel, or the um, sea star that I have in his mouth. So I don't understand what the purpose of this is, but hey guys, so this totally happened when I was trying to put a deco bit on him. His head, and I'm sorry, I'm shaking the camera, but his head just popped off, and yeah, I mean, I know they snap right back on, but it was like a little bit too easy to pop off. Let's attach this, let's reattach this, guys. Oof. So here's everything that I got in the set. I'm really, really liking it. Uh, there's some things I don't like about it, but there are many things that I do. I'm not trying to sound like I'm bragging. I apologize if it came across that way to anyone. It's on all of my videos. I never try to brag in any way, shape, or form, and I'm very thankful for this. So yeah. So I hope you all liked the video, and if you did, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe for more. Bye, guys!